Uh, I know him. We know him as SNE. Mm -hmm. It's right here in the building. Give it up for the superstar, SNE. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hey, how are you? I'm uh, doing good. How are you doing? Nah, I'm doing great. Welcome to Nigeria. <sighs> nice to be here. Uh, uh, is it your time? first time? Yes. <laughs> definitely, yes. Definitely, definitely. How are you feeling? Um, no, I'm feeling good. Uh, the weather is hot. Ah, it mm. is. It is quite nah, hot. But uh, apart from that, the energy is amazing. Uh -huh. mm. Nigerians, what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> what is the weather like? <laughs> What um, is the weather like? In SA. Yes. Mm. Nah, SA is, is, is cool. It's it's more of... It gets cold during winter. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, but here, yeah, I've realized there's no winter. There's, <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, it doesn't there's depend no on the part of SA you're talking about. Any yeah, there's part. also... Nah, there's also... It also depends on parts, but mm. um, it gets cold in all parts. Just mm. that other parts are colder than others. Yeah. Mm. yeah. All right. Well, let me ask you a question straight right into it. I know I, I, I usually I like to build up, but this one I need to ask. Uh, I feel like um, this is the first time in the last three or four years that a South African record has gone top of the charts in Nigeria. I think the last time was K-Star with Vocalistic and David Doe. Mm -hmm. How does that make you feel as a musician, knowing that your record or a record you were featured on has jumped to the top of the charts and not just maybe in SA, but also in Nigeria as well? Um, I would say it's so overwhelming because um it was something that i i didn't expect i was not planning for it to happen mm -hmm. you know you 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 always have the height you want to reach and yeah. then it goes way beyond i'm like okay so it's 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 amazing for uh -huh. me it feels so uh, i have so much gratitude because i also understand that um it was not my thing mm. it was not me who, who who pushed this to happen like this uh, there was a greater uh, power which is i believe in jesus all so, right yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> love that for are you, you under pressure in any way to replicate you know it's like you said you know you have a thing in your Definitely. mind where you think it's gonna go and it's just gone way above it right definitely do you have a little bit of pressure or anxiety thinking that wow I'm, how am i gonna do this again um yes yes i do uh but i also believe in uh, myself and mm -hmm. and the talent that i have yeah. yeah i think i think there's so much already i have so much so many songs that i i can't wait to give the world mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so um, I'm I'm kind of ready, but I do have anxiety. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm ready for for the world. Let's yeah. kick it. Uh, are the rumors true, though? You know, people are swelling. Rumors are swelling about that my um, piano has been stolen by Nigerians. Okay. And and okay. is that? Do you believe, okay. as a South African musician, do you think that the genre my piano has been stolen by our Nigerian musicians? Um, no. The um, <laughs> I don't wanna. I'm not trying to offend anybody. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but um, I I usually don't wanna um entertain those type of um, dramas because I mm. feel like they they are, they they are. It's like we're supposed to be one, but mm. now there's this thing that they keep using to 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 separate, the divide, you know. Mm. So I feel like uh, those type of um, uh, topics they they so uh, divisive. Of course, mm -hmm. so. Um, so you run away from that? I'm a piano. No, no, I don't run away. I can mm. answer the question. I, yeah. I would say I'm a piano is, 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 we can't deny the fact that it comes from South Africa. All right. You yeah. see, so um, I would say South Africa has, has, has the best I'm a piano artist there. You know, but Nigerians, they, they're so good at, you know, taking things and, and giving them that, you know, <laughs> that Niger that Niger, feel. You see, uh -huh. so I, would, I would give them that, but I hate to, 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 to Niger this, South Africa this. Uh, I, mm -hmm. I feel like we, we all won. Um, I feel like also it's like the body. If, if, if a hand does this, you can't compare the hand with, with the leg mm -hmm. because also Niger has its own thing going on and they're so dope with it, you know. So, um, so I'm a pianist South African, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> or fortunately. Or fortunately. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. Well, um, you know, let's get back to the music. I want to talk about the link up with yourself and the producers. How are their names pronounced? Um Tito M. Yes. Is one of the yes. producers. Tito M. Tito M. And then UP. Yes. UP is one of the producers. Uh -huh. And then EQ, EQ. is one of the uh, vocalists. Mm -hmm. 
and then as well as yourself. S and e yes. Mm -hmm. So how did that link up happen? First of all, is it the first time you're working with the producers? And um, seeing that you're featured on the record, um, it would mean that did they reach out to you? Was it like a collaborative effort? How did it all crazy come together? Crazy story. <laughs> so what happened was, um, I was working on 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 on. Oh, someone sent me a beat. Okay. And then when they sent me a beat, I recorded Chalabami on that beat. And then when uh, that someone released the song, my, he took out my vocals. Whoa. So it was not cutting it for him. So yeah. he, uh, he released the beat without the vocals. And then UP, one of the producers, took the vocals and then created a beat on top of uh, the vocals. And then that Tito M added mm -hmm. those things. And then um, EQ added a verse on top. Oh. And then... Yeah, that's how so the they created came. the beats around your vocals. Of course. Uh -huh. yeah, of course. Uh, that's interesting. Very interesting. I'm loving the uh, process to which the song was made, but also the dance. We cannot deny how viral <laughs> the dance has gone. Mm -hmm. uh, do you think we've gotten to the point where the dance is a lot more bigger than the song? Um, the song is as beautiful as the dance. Mm -hmm. um, it, it's one response that I've, uh, I keep on getting. After, mm. you know, when it, that... Mm -hmm. like part was trending mm -hmm. uh, people thought it was one of those tiktok songs where um it's gonna be a, a a nice hook and then once you hear the full song you're like ah that's about it yeah mm -hmm. but it got worse after we dropped the song because that's when people now started to hear the first verse the other parts where it, it was not trending mm -hmm. so there was mm -hmm. like for me the response that we kept on getting it was the song is amazing it 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 got rid of the thing of tiktok music is web music mm -hmm. you know so the virality of the dance wasn't it like two guys at first wasn't it the it first was people three guys three nah, guys three and then guys. they were who are the three do you know the three guys um i don't know their names specifically but uh -huh. i met them we met yeah. uh they also on the music video uh -huh. so they were dancing to it was not even Jolabami. they were dancing to an another song in a party they were vibing it was not even a plan to create a mm -hmm. dance. They were just vibing to the song. And then someone took that, uh, placed Jolabami on onto it. that. Uh -huh. And then people were like, this is it. Uh -huh. this Everyone is dance. jumped in, uh -huh. jumped yeah. in, jumped in. <laughs> and then did you have to learn the dance too? It's like, oh, oh well, now I have to learn course, this dance. Of course, I was like, hey, these, <laughs> these boys, now I have to. <laughs> <laughs> because people are like, oh, you sing the song. So, so you, you have, have to, to do the dance. Now. I'm like, I... But uh, I learned. I tried. Uh -huh. I tried. I'm way better than I was at first. You can, <laughs> you can go look into my Instagram. The first ones, I was like, oh, yeah, it was it was off. Yeah, it was yeah. not sure. So speak, speaking of learning, I think um, also we need to learn something about you. You said your name. Obviously, we we'll call you SNE. But I think more people will want to understand where that SNE stems from. You know, what is the full meaning of the name, and what does it mean, uh, so that okay. we as Nigerians can understand. Um, okay, so for now, there is a meaning, but I have I have something um special that i'm gonna do to reveal the name mm. okay because i've been getting that question a lot so uh -huh. yeah let's let's wait for that you know outside of the dance you know when you get over like oh my god there's a dance attached to it and it's such a jam yeah and then you actually listen the, the melodies record, yeah. are so sweet i love it i love it a lot what does it mean though because i realize that we're just dancing away but we have no idea um, what you're saying it means my alcohol so the entire lyrics of the chorus it's a conversation between me and alcohol oh, oh. wow <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying to alcohol what is uh, alcohol saying i'm back? complaining i'm complaining <laughs> i'm like uh, alcohol is nice but also you know the things that it, it do does to my life. yeah the effects mm -hmm. yeah so oh, it's wow. more it's more of like a love hate relationship between oh, wow. me and alcohol and uh -huh. uh, yeah all right so well, you're complaining of course, <laughs> of course let, yes, I am. Let, let's talk a bit about um your experience since you got to nigeria when when did you arrive to the country um i think a day ago two days ago two days, yeah, ago. Two days ago all right besides our nigerian food what else do you love um ooh, the designs here the houses are different it's mm. like Yo, you guys have, have something going on in terms of the, <laughs> the designs. Do you love the designs? Yes, or? I love them. Yeah. I love them so much. Mm. They're so, yeah, they they, they different. They, Do you see yourself ever one day saying, you know, I would love to stay in Nigeria, just leave in Nigeria? Um, I would be homesick. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to I'd love to come to Nigeria mm. for, 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 not for work, just to come for... for Relaxation. For, yeah, you know, uh -huh. A December vibe. 
uh, visiting places mm. you know, for a vacation to mm. be precise yeah the success of this song are you seeing the impu or the are you seeing it on your other songs are people now going to find other music that you've dropped um, or stuff that you've done before um i, I have no uh, music you have no artists. music this is your mm. mu- the first yeah. song that you have I, out. Wow. I was planning i was planning on uh, releasing a project which was not even on my piano okay. Oh, okay. And, until Chalabami hijacked me you know mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, but also now I have so much uh, planned for, for, for you guys because I've been doing music for so long so now I'm, I'm it, it, there's 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 more on the bag so yeah. I'm, I'm i'm trying to put everything into order and also make sure that i don't confuse the fans i'm trying to make yeah. everything make sense yeah yeah, yeah. I, I, if you've been doing music for so long how come this is like in 2024 is the first time you're putting out official music what's been happening um, since i'm I, i'm a perfectionist okay. all right that's my number one problem so i i i i would prepare 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 and then next thing i'm like yo four years has passed i've been preparing preparing and it's it's making but but what it has done for me yeah Mm -hmm. i have so much to offer now because yeah there's so many songs so many genres there's literally very few genres i haven't touched okay so I've, I've done so many genres so many songs uh, and now i'm gonna be releasing um a project but it Firstly, I'm gonna. It, I don't think it's gonna be this year, but this year I'm gonna be dropping singles, a lot of singles, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. just to follow up after Chalabang. The See, the project that you had ready, what genre was it? Am I piano? Am I piano? Am I piano? Oh, the one that I was before oh, the piano had checked you. It was Afro, Afro beat, Afro pop. Yeah. yeah. So okay. so since you already planned to, or were you were planning to drop an album, uh, Afro beats uh, album. Uh, do you think maybe there's a chance that you could have a collaboration with some Afrobeat artists for, yes, maybe from Nigeria? Definitely. Mm-hmm. definitely. I would Any, love anybody to. in mind who you consider or you would love uh, to work with? Ashake. Ashake? Ooh. Oh, that's the first name that jumped into your head. How come? No, because uh, I love Ashake so much. All right. I, um, I think a huge part of Ashake's music uh-huh. uh, influenced the previous project that I was Wow. Working, you know, so... Yeah. Yeah. I'd, I would love to work with him. Mm. Mm. But now, hence I'm on I'm a piano. Also, I don't think um, if you're an artist, I feel like you can jump into anything as long as you're an artist. You mm-hmm. can just create paint. It's more of like painting. Yeah. You can paint in any wall. All it doesn't right. need to be a board. It doesn't need to be. If you can paint, you can paint literally anywhere. Uh-huh. So I think I look at it the same way with mm-hmm. genres. If you so you're not restricting yourself to one genre. You could do on a piano. You could do yes, soul. You could do Afro beats. You could do whatever you want to do. Literally. But wow. the next project we're getting is a piano project. Yeah, I'm a piano definitely. All right. Sure. Is is there a particular reason why you've decided to say this new project? Is it because of the success of this record? Um, it's because I don't want to confuse the people. Okay, makes okay. sense. Yeah, yeah I don't want to confuse. I want um I want everyone to to I I also want to have a smooth transition from I'm a piano to 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 afro you uh, know, another genre yeah, if another need, genre need, if, yeah. yeah so i don't wanna just rapidly everyone was expecting it all my piano and then boom yeah mm-hmm. i am pulling up with something else yeah, <laughs> yeah. that would be confusing <laughs> it, it, it's so funny how as as much as we always like you mentioned time and time again uh, there's a lot of unity in africa there's also this bit of healthy competition Mm-hmm. Into so to speak, mm-hmm. and there's a lot of that with regards to Nigeria and and South Africa, and as, many, as well as many other countries. Mm-hmm. Uh, and we've seen the healthy rivalry many times, even in sports. Uh, the the last the last the last outcome. There was a lot of you know interesting things that that transpired. I mean, I know you love Nigeria, and I'm sure that of course you you love your home country as well. But uh, were you being patriotic when you were supporting your country, or were you weirdly enough supporting Nigeria in that game? Um, hmm, you want to, <laughs> want to <peanut>. just <laughs> <laughs> what other answer is he going to give? You to never this know. Question? Maybe, <laughs> may, may, maybe you For love Nigerian. Maybe you love Nigerian girls. Maybe he's got a Nigerian Let me tell you, he cannot even say <laughs> it. There's only one answer. Let, me, let him question. speak now. <laughs> let him speak. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. I, I still want to get out of here alive. Yeah. <laughs> Two, I still want to be accepted when I get back, back home. home. No, no, we love you regardless. <laughs> so, I. 
that one let me run away <laughs> <laughs> but, but i mean regardless i think that there's a lot of competition even in the music as mm. well and it yeah. plays and i'm sure that there's going to be a situation where if you do put out an Afrobeat record, uh, there's a collaboration maybe with somebody from Nigeria, it would be super fire because yes. Nigerians and South Africans always make great music. I mean, Together, uh-huh. AK and Burner Boy, yeah, David yeah, Doe, and Fakale, yes, you know, so many amazing people. It's always going to be fire. So we're looking forward to that happening. Um, besides um, Ashake that you mentioned, which um, artist, maybe not from not Nigerian, inspires your music as well? Um, yo, I used to listen to a lot of Drake. Um, yeah. I used to listen to a lot of. I used to listen to hip hop in general. Yeah. One of the genres hip-hop. that you were doing was it rap? Yes, it was. Uh-huh. Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> Considering the flows, yeah, yeah. You, you can hear on Jalabami. There's flows. There's wordplay there. There's yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So that's that's absolutely amazing. What does Shwalabami even mean? You know, you've told us what the song in its entirety mean, but the title, yeah. what exactly is it? My alcohol. My alcohol. Shwalabam. My alcohol. Yeah. The reason why inside the song it's me talking to alcohol. Aha. Uh-huh. So How do you alcohol. see my alcohol in Yoruba? Huh. I don't know. Alcohol <laughs> me. Oti me. Otimi. Yes. Otimi. Uh, Oti. <laughs> he not like right? he knows. Yeah. He knows. Otimi. I got that right. <laughs> Love it, love it. I think we're going to probably wrap up right now. Uh, I want to know one more thing. All right. What do you like to do? Because, you know, we've been talking about movies. I mean, we're talking music and stuff. Yeah, Yeah, but, you know, if you're on vacation and you're not making any music and you're just chilling, you're as a guy, what are some things that you're into? What do you like to do? Play games, cook, Um, sleep? I would say... Um, I love to to have conversations. You know, I like to meet new people, have conversations, share views, uh-huh. uh, know what you what you on about, what you thinking, what are your thoughts, what are your views, mm. and share mine. You know, I think I I I I, I love it. I love mm. me a good conversation. Yeah? Mm. yeah, you think you'd make a good radio presenter? Um, I think so. Yeah, <laughs> I like it. I like, I like it. that. I like, we could swap jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe one day next time you come, you could co-host instead of being. Yes. Yes. Hear your thoughts and other things. Yeah, you want like too much, (laughs) (laughs) 